What's up guys, NVIDIA's GeForce RTX 4060 Ti custom models have started popping up in online databases, and we now know the clock speeds of one such model. The clock speeds come from Tech Power Up's GPU database editor T4C Fantasy, who has shared the specifications for Colorful's iGame GeForce RTX 4060 Ti Ultra WOC graphics card. This model features a custom design that includes a non-reference PCB and cooling solution and comes with factory overclocks of up to 2000. 1580 MHz, which is a 45 MHz boost over the reference clock speeds. It looks like the overclocks won't be as big as we saw with the RTX 4070 variants, but your games will still be able to squeeze in some extra performance. Other than that, T4C Fantasy also reports that the NVIDIA GeForce RTX 4060 Ti is still showing up with 8GB GDDR6 VRAM. While that may change, earlier rumors have pointed to 8GB, and if that really ends up being the case, it'll be kind of a down considering the RTX 3060 had 12 gigabytes of GDDR6 VRAM, and while the 3060 Ti went with 8 gigabytes, it didn't have its bus interface at 128 bit. Both last gen 3060 series cards featured 192 and 256 bit bus interfaces, respectively. A 128 bit solution on the RTX 4060 series would suggest that they will most definitely be targeting 1080p gamers, and the extra cash might compensate for some form of entry level 1440p gaming on the T value. Variant. The GeForce RTX 4060 Ti is expected to utilize the AD106 350A1 GPU core, a cut-down version of the full AD106 graphics chip, and based on rumors, it should pack 34 SMs or 4,352 CUDA cores, an 8GB GDDR6 memory running at 18 gigabits per second across a 128-bit bus interface, providing the card with 288GB per second of bandwidth. There's also 32 megabytes of L2 cache on board the GPU, which is an 8x increase over the GeForce RTX 3060 Ti. Using the rumored reference boost frequency as a reference, the NVIDIA GeForce RTX 4060 Ti should offer around 22 teraflops of compute performance, with AIB models boosting it close to 24 teraflops. Based on the numbers on your screens, it looks like the NVIDIA GeForce RTX 4060 Ti graphics card is going to end up similar to the GeForce RTX 3070 Ti in performance. The 3070 Ti launched at $600, so the 4060 Ti would have to be positioned close to $400 to make it a worthy successor to the 3060 Ti, which also had the same MSRP. Guys, what do you think about these graphic cards? Let me know in the comment section below. Also, share this video with your friends. Thank you for watching, see you in the next one. Good luck to all!